been married for four years. Good morning, Jamie. Hey, how's it going, everyone? Um, so why don't you explain to the guys a little bit what is going on and um, why you wrote to us in the first place? Yeah, um, I think my wife, Jody, cheated. Um, you know, we, we've been married for four years, and I called her two times, uh, you know, in the past couple months, um, and she uh, says she's somewhere where she's not. Um, you know, this uh, first time was over the summer, and she said she was going to go to the beach with her sister, and it turns out that she's in Myrtle Beach with this uh, bad influence friend who uh, she's at the bachelorette party. Um, okay. And so she, so he had said that she uh, she was never going to hang out with her anymore. You know, um, and uh, you know, um, I just she uh, she would upset me uh, if I found out that she was partying. Um, so she lied uh, and. And uh, a couple months ago, these weird phone numbers uh, were showing up on the phone book, and, you know, she said that it's work, but it, it, it's a guy co-worker, and, you know, he doesn't need to be calling her that much. She works at a bar, so the only reason why he didn't call is if they need to, like, have a shift to cover the agent. Mm-hmm. She just feels like she's being shady. Okay. Overall, you know? Yeah, yeah. Um, and so, real quick, when you say that she's been caught two times. I mean, I know that you were just telling us about that, but has she actually done anything that physically, you know like, physically with anybody, or is it just that she's been shady a couple times? Yeah. Just that she's been shady. You know, like, I I've see. not caught her with anybody, but caught her I feel like I can't trust her and something feels wrong. Right. All right. Well, listen, I think, you know, we would like to help you here, and if you're ready and, and still willing, we would like to do the War of the Roses call for you, if that's okay? Yeah. Yeah, please. Thank you. All right. And um, we will work to get your wife on the phone. So hold on just a minute. Hello? Yeah, is this Jody? Yes. Yeah, hi. My name is Mike with How are you? I'm great. How are you? Doing great. I have some good news. Um, we are doing a promotion this time of year where we're giving away free trips every single day. And we um, have some promotional boxes out in the triad. And it's kind of one of those things where you put your name in. We encourage people to put a name of their friend in. And we drew your name today. And we have a romantic getaway for two to Myrtle Beach anytime next year. Really? That's awesome. Yeah. Basically, it's real simple. It's a romantic getaway for two. We make it really nice, romantic with you know, all the things that you'd want, flowers and chocolate and other things and all we need from you we have your first and last name is the first and last name of the person that you would like to take with you that will help speed up the process okay i just have one question sure does does the person have to travel with me or can they meet me at the resort well yeah i mean it's, it, it, there's no plane ticket or anything they can meet you there it's not a problem just for checking in purposes and stuff they just need to know who's going to be there okay um i'll be taking brian Brian, all right. Yes, that sounds great. You've got to be kidding me. What? Hello? You would stay with Brian, Jody. Uh, hi, Jimmy. Yeah. What? What are you doing? I, what is this? Yeah, this is your husband. Okay, I, I don't even know what's going on, Jamie. What is going on? Where? Where did you come from? I was just talking to this guy, and now what? What is happening? Uh, I uh, I just set this up because you've been acting weird, and um, I was right. How long has this been going on? Like, like eight months. <sighs> yeah, we're done. You need to get all your. From the house and not be there when I get home. Come on, Brian. Or Jamie, God. I'm so sorry. Know that I, you know that We're I don't done. want to hurt you. We're done. No, please. Let's just talk about this. Please. Jody, this is uh, Jared and Katie in the morning on 107.5 KZL. Um, your husband, Jamie, contacted us and he thought that you were being shady 
and thought that maybe something was going on. So are you in a sexual relationship with this guy, Brian? I can't believe you did this on the radio. Well, and then you also, so I can't couldn't... Believe, you called him the guy's name you're taking to a romantic trip with you. You called your husband, Brian. It was just a slip of the tongue. It happens. People well, get tongue twisted when mm-hmm. they're nervous and upset. And I'm really upset right now because I, I just need him to talk to me. I can't believe we're doing this right now. This is insane. Jamie, do you want to yeah, continue? I'm sorry that you feel embarrassed right now. So what's with taking... Can you please just talk to me without the radio? I want you to get all of your and be gone when I get home. I'm not going to do that. We, You and I need to talk about this. Please, we need to talk about this. This can't... We haven't had any kind of discussion, and I need to explain to you, and we can fix this. No. No, not for eight months. Thanks, 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 thanks for setting this up. Can I go? Can this be done? Yeah, sure. you can go. Sure. Okay, thanks. Jamie, please. 